G'day everyone, Viv here. I hope you're all keeping well. Welcome back to Nights of Dice. It is absolutely chilly here in Melbourne today. It's Monday, it's time for a new week. I'm looking forward to it. I've got a feeling I might be getting sick again, which is terrible, but we'll see how that goes. I hope you have a wonderful week. We've got lots to do here in the studio. I wasn't here last week. I had other business uh, with my software company, so that prevented me from getting a lot of the stuff that I wanted to get done done but uh, I'm working through that. And the first part of that is some new shapes for Create It. We've uploaded a bunch of the um, uh, Re uh, Separatists and um, Republic shapes for um, you know four or five different ships. There's still one left that we need to do and I'm gonna duck out today and see if I can buy it. Uh, I buy that or buy it. Uh, but I wanted to film this quick video. We have released an update to Create It last week. Um, one of the biggest uh, changes in that release was the ability to add multiple trays from the Creator software to the WooCommerce shopping cart that we use for Knights of Dice. In the past, if you created a, a, a tray or what we call a canvas in Create It and submitted it to the cart, it would be perfectly fine. If the, you went then went back to create it, created a new canvas and submitted it to the cart, it would overwrite the one that you'd already put there, meaning that you could only put one thing in your cart. There was also an issue with how things were added to the cart. If you added something from Create It first and then added something from the website, it wouldn't like it. You needed to add things from the website first and then add things from Create It or in some sequence, I can't quite remember which way it worked, but that has now been fixed. You can go to Create It, create your own uh, custom canvas, add it to the cart, go shopping on the Knights of Dice website, add whatever you want to the cart, then go back to create it, you create a new tray, add that to the cart, and everything will work perfectly fine. So if you've used Creator in the past um, and had issues submitting multiple trays to the shopping cart, you won't have that problem anymore. Um, I'd like to get a whole bunch of videos done for Creator either this week or next week. I haven't scheduled it into my work at the moment. There are other pending items that need to be finished. But um, there we go, uh, it's, I'm not looking forward to today. All the heaters in the warehouse, everywhere, front, back, offices are on. I'm hoping it warms up at some stage because it's terribly cold. Um, but there we go, big change to Create It, mostly to do with how the shopping cart interacts with uh, uh, Create It. Uh, if you have any questions, you know, post them in the link below or feel free to give us a call or shoot us an email, however you like to contact us. We are here to help you and uh, I hope you have a wonderful week. I hope it's not as cold where you are. <laughs> Have a good week. See ya. Bye.